Hello everyone, I'm outside the Friary here in the state of Massachusetts. And my purpose for being here was to give a retreat on healing for the staff and the listeners of WQPH Catholic Radio. Each, uh, each, each day we had a, a mass uh, with, uh, with prayers for the sick. And then following mass, we had um, a time of adoration but it was a healing service with the Blessed Sacrament. So I hope you enjoy these clips, you know, and let the Lord touch you as you watch the highlights from our retreat from this past week. One question that may be on our minds sometimes, especially when life becomes very difficult, when the hardships are increasing, when it appears that everything is just going wrong. He says, why is God permitting this? Why does he allow, allow me to undergo such an ordeal, no such suffering, and that's one thing that it's it's always very difficult to understand why we have to suffer. The answers are not always there, but we have somebody who shows us how to embrace suffering and how to overcome suffering. And this is our Lord Jesus Christ. So, for us to be healed and going through this narrow gate, what does this mean? What are you talking about, Father? Some of us have some very deep wounds and, for, and, and, and we, we don't like to think about them. And some of us have not prayed for healing because we don't want to face these wounds. See, but God wants to take them. See, this is not a journey we enter, entereth alone. He is there with us. He is our consoler. He is our comforter. So many of us, we need to go beyond the threshold of the narrow gate and enter it. But in the threshold, we come face to face with the pain, with the hurt. And that is difficult. But Jesus knows that. And he is, he is there with us.
but here is Jesus. And Jesus tells us, Matthew chapter 11, he says, come to me. Come to me, those who are heavy burdened. Come to me, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. And there he will give us rest. There he will deliver us. There he will set us free and he will raise us up. I hope you enjoyed watching our highlights from the retreat of this past week and know that the friars are always praying for you and we're always praying that those who watch and listen to EWTN or watch outside the friary we pray that, the, that you too may be healed all of us are wounded in some way or another and Jesus the Lord is a great healer the great miracle worker and he will do the impossible his love is always outpouring all we need to do is believe and know that he is God and that he can do all things. So brothers and sisters, thanks again for watching. Know again we're praying for you. And please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tell all your friends about this. And may Almighty God bless you all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.